And so every book is different. Yeah, like you mentioned, Paper Girls was something Cliff and I had first worked together on a Swamp Thing story a million years ago, and I'd written a, a short Swamp Thing story at Vertigo, and uh, no artist wanted to draw it because I was a nobody, and I'm sure the script was terrible, and they're like, well, all we have is one of our assistant editors said he would draw it. I was like, this is going to be terrible. But uh, it was Cliff Chang, and it was the first printed work that he ever did. And it was some of the best art that I'd ever seen in my life. And I just so lucked out. And uh, we were like, we have to work together again. And I think that was 1999 when we worked together. So it took us years and years to do that. But we finally circled back around. So sometimes it's lucky that I was partnered with someone like Marcos by a Marvel editor. You know, and then we chose to work together. But Fiona, I think that was me. The idea came first, and then it was just seeking out artists. And it's so hard to find. Artists are like, this is a non-superhero book, and uh, it's got a bunch of swearing and boobs in it. It's, you know, like, I don't want to draw this. And uh, I talked with a writer named Steve Niles, who's incredible, and Steve is like, there's an artist named Fiona Staples who not only can draw anything, she will draw anything. <laughs> And yeah, so I reached out to her and uh, sort of pitched her the idea, and she's like, this sounds incredibly weird. I'll dedicate decades of my life to this. So I'm just, yeah, I'm so lucky.